Here is how to properly use Oban in BTD6. To start, he is one of, if not the easiest hero to use. His early game is great with his seeking attacks, and there is a very clear way to get the most out of him. Additionally, his level 3 ability Brambles gives a nice boost of damage at specific times, or can be placed down early in preparation for the harder rounds to come. One weird thing is that Brambles actually pairs great with an Alchemist as the damage and pierce buffs affect it similar to Spike Factories. In fact, an Elk buffed level 7 Brambles can deal up to 309 damage instead of the usual 100. But because Oban's damage in the late game is pretty weak, putting an elk buff on him can be a waste if you're tight on cash. At level 10, Oban unlocks his Wall of Trees ability. In every game mode but chimps, put these trees as far forward as possible as it'll make you quite a bit of extra cash anytime they burst. These do not make any extra money in chimps though, so we'll want to put them near the end of the track to keep any balloons from leaking. When it comes to the late game, Oban's damage and abilities are underwhelming, so you are mostly using him for his buffs to magic monkeys. For the most part, this buff is really weak and easily outclassed by other hero buffs like Pat Fusty. This goes for all magic monkeys except the druid, as Oban gives them extra buffs. Because of this, there are two good chimp strats that work with Oban, and they are the Spirit of the Forest and the Avatar of Wrath. The basic game plan is to get down Oban early, get two discount villages, and seven druids inside their range. We'll make five of these pop lusts, the one farthest back will become a druid of the storm, and the one farthest forward will either become an Avatar of Wrath or a Spirit of the Forest. Then, just buff them with a few 401 elks and buy some support monkeys and they'll take down chimps on many maps. This plan leaves tons of money left over for you to spend on whatever you'd like. What I normally do is get a Bloon Jitsu Ninja and Stronger Stim Alchemist down early. This way I get to use the Elk Buffed Brambles for tons of damage early on and I get to rely on an Elk Buffed Ninja for the mid game while we save up for the villages. Outside of chimps, Oban has one more important buff. He gives middle path druids extra range, which is great when you are using jungle's bounty to farm some money. While not the best way to farm, Oban's buff will let you fit more farms inside their range, letting them make more money per ability. This way, you can make a solid income while defending in game modes like Impoppable. But that is how to properly use Oban in BTD6.